Ask us your questions. Pipe boy. Alrighty, so uh, first of all, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Alright, welcome back to another video. And firstly, I just want to thank you guys for the support on yesterday's video. It's already at like 60,000 views. So uh, yeah, I appreciate that. Uh, you guys have been showing a lot of support on the channel recently, and you guys have been enjoying the topics. Also, happy holidays, dude. This year's went by super fast, and we already close to literally being the end of the year. And my birthday, too. But listen, that's besides the point, alright? Because I found out a lot of stuff that's been going on with Miaba that I did not know about because I've not been keeping tabs on her. And I just had to talk about this one because of apparently she got arrested as well which is uh just wow like seriously this chick just can't get enough of being an npc like i seriously don't know anyone who has such a terrible life like this is this is pathetic can't say i feel bad for her either so uh yeah without further ado we're gonna buckle up and uh go ahead and get right into this video so uh yeah let's go now as you guys know from yesterday's video if you watched it which if you haven't uh go ahead and watch that right now well not right now after you watch this one of course come on now but pretty much uh miaba faked her death and uh well that's not the reason she got arrested we're gonna get into that but pretty much, yeah, she faked her death. And if you want more context on that, like I said, go ahead and go ahead and watch that video after you're done with this one. Now, Mialba uh, getting arrested is a pretty long story. And I'm just going to start off by giving a little bit of context. Uh, so, yeah, here we go. Now, pretty much, Mialba obviously has a Discord server or had one before it got deleted. And she made multiple new ones. But her original one, let's just say it was huge. It had like 300k members in there. Absolute, just massive, dude. And well, obviously, a lot of Mialba stands were in there. And a lot of people who just blindlessly followed, uh, you know... Meowba and listen to whatever she did and just were overall victims if you ask me because most of the people involved in this were children and most of the people involved in most of the controversies this chick has gotten in are kids. Now pretty much without getting into too much details, Meowba pretty much made people in her server do stuff to themselves and harm themselves in many ways which was uh, obviously just disgusting alright and it, it, I don't want to get into too many details because it's pretty graphic and a sensitive topic but yeah Meowba is an absolute scumbag as well as her also involving herself in people distributing let's just say content that should never ever ever be in the possession of any person ever and if you have a brain cell you can probably put what i mean together let's just say it involves children and i'm not going to go into further detail than that there's been many videos made on this and that's why i know about this and there's been lots of people who have confronted me well not confronted but came to me with this information and wanted me to make videos on it and have told me a lot about me alba uh, especially including her getting arrested which is what that all leads into now pretty much people reported me alba to police and she ended up getting in trouble due to this and you know facing jail time possibly due to her server and just the problem she's overall caused and the highly illegal stuff she's involved herself in so when i say meow is a scumbag i'm not talking about content she's overall a terrible person and i don't know why anybody would support her like she still actively has a lot and when i say a lot i mean a lot of stands dude like people who will openly defend her and it's really pathetic like when i tell you meow might be the worst person i've seen on the internet in a long on time it's 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 honestly it's it's the truth dude now a lot of the screenshots and the proof of what i've mentioned in this video can't be shown because it just goes against youtube's guidelines all right it's so graphic the stuff that really shows me about dark side but i'm pretty sure there's videos out there exposing this and well i know for a fact i've seen them uh if i can find them i will definitely link them in the description because they go really in depth yes me has gotten in trouble in the law she's been in custody she's been also facing time due to what she's had in her server as well so uh yeah this woman isn't just someone who's just a troll nah she's a genuine scumbag dude like bro if you ever run in with this woman i say the best thing to do is uh run the opposite way get away from her uh if you ever see her or have any contact with her uh, run the opposite way all right run for your life because you're never gonna recover your brain cells are gonna evaporate now one of the videos made on miaba that talked about her and the whole arrested thing and just overall what's going on in her server is uh tom dark all right or turkey tom uh if, if you guys know him by that he made a video talking about it and it's called miaba is evil I'm not gonna play it in this video, but if you want to go find it, you can find it. It's literally called Me Alba's Evil. It's made by Tom Dark. So go watch that. It gives a very in-depth uh, explanation as to what was going on in her server and why exactly she's getting in trouble. Like so many people try to defend her and just say anything made on her saying such and such happened to her is clickbait. And like I don't understand how people don't literally see what's going on in the situation to look at all the evidence and realize that it's a hundred percent real. Like, bro, this chick is a hundred percent faked her death. She's a hundred percent done what she's done in her server and 
everything that has been said to been going on with her recently has it been true I, I don't know why so many people defend her I, I don't get it it's like so many people just defend terrible people the last thing you should want to do is defend someone of this caliber like I, I, I don't think people understand that Miyaba has passed the troll level of everything in her persona like she has passed that not only has she disrespected Technoblade passing away but she's also done horrible things to people and become such a, a genuine scumbag like there is levels to just being a troll and to being a horrible person like bro she's past the point of being a troll she is just a genuine terrible person that no one should really interact with like just to put it into perspective how much of an absolute scumbag she is let me show you the videos and things she posted after it was announced that technoblade passed away just warning y'all it's probably gonna trigger you and make you mad nine times out of ten if you at least have a heart you're gonna feel some type of way about this so uh yeah let, let, let's see exactly what she posted That's uh, one of the videos of her disrespecting Technoblade, and uh, I'm not gonna even show the art that she ended up making about this, which was uh, just horrible. Like, when I say horrible, I'm not sugarcoating it. It was it was disgusting, like absolutely weird. Let me show you another TikTok she ended up making too uh, about Technoblade after he passed away. Think of a big black man chasing you. Yeah, that's pretty much what she made, and uh, wow, to say that's disgusting is uh, the, the least thing I could possibly say, it's just, it is, it is horrific, it is absolutely horrific, this chick, I, she must be nuked, she must be stopped, despawned, alright, something needs to happen, seriously, this is so beyond messed up that I, I just can't explain, like, I don't think it, like I said, it takes a genius to understand this, am I happy she got arrested, yeah, I hope she goes to jail for what she's done, because genuinely, it's so messed up, that, like, I, I can't explain how scummy and severely disturbed this is. Something is extremely wrong with this chick's brain. Like, the fact that Clout is really driving her to do all this is mind-boggling. But, you know, we're gonna be reacting to something to kind of lighten up the mood, alright, to stop talking about such dark stuff. And this is pretty much a gotcha video made of Jellybean uh, reacting to Miyaba or something like that, alright? Some gotcha stuff with Jellybean and Miyaba. It's kind of still cringe, but we're gonna, we're gonna watch it, alright? So, come on. Part 1 of Mioba and Jelly Bean react to their TikToks. How does Shorty still manage to be cringe in Gotcha Life? Like, the creator itself ain't got no problem with them, alright? Shout out to them for making this video, but it's just the fact that Meowba is in here and Jelly Bean. Like, Meowba, how you manage to be cringe in Gotcha? You're an absolute NPC. Like, there's literally no saving this chick at this point. She is beyond the point of saving, alright? Nothing will save her. She will forever be an NPC. Don't ask me what's going on, all right? Uh, I, I I have no idea what's going on. I'm I'm here to, to just cringe and react to Meowba, all right, and clown on her. I could care less about what what this lore is.
I'm just as confused as you are, alright? I'm I'm very lost, alright? We're here to talk about Meow by getting rested, and I tried to make it a little more lighthearted, you know, talking about the whole Technoblade thing, and this is what we get, alright? This is what we get, the most random thing ever, right? What is this video? Please, please tell me, what is this? Like, I I'm, I'm so confused, like, I I'm so genuinely lost. Like, dude, I, I honestly, every time I open YouTube and I open my editing software, figure out a video to talk about, I never know what to expect because, dude, the most random things could happen. You never know what's gonna happen, ever. So seriously, it's it's honestly just so mind-boggling that, that I'm even sitting here watching this right now because I'm lost and confused. You think I really have the brain capacity to digest what any of this means? No, of course I don't. Eating me off TikTok comments. Can you now meow? Meow! Can you eat Japanese? Meow does not have a race. Meow is a doll. Dolls don't have races, silly. Meow wa ni hongo. Meow, Meow, can you say this kawaii word? Retard. Okay, retard. Hi, Meow. Can we ever get a face review? Animal review. Meow talks in third person. Please use she, meow, magic, or dull pronouns for meow. I owe that bitch is copying me. I genuinely wonder what Jellybean thinks of Meowba, though. Like, they've been compared so many times. I wonder what her opinion is on Meowba currently, or how she feels about her, or, you know, what's going on with that. Because I know she knows who she is. I know Jellybean knows who Meowba is, but I really wonder what she fully thinks about her. I'm pretty sure she thinks what we all think, that the chick's crazy. But I'm actually pretty curious to, to, to think about, well, to one, well, to what. Hey, why are you copying me? Meow was not copying, Meow was inspired. Stop saying Meow in every two seconds. Meow says what Meow likes. Can she notice me? Wow! Meow the bad page! I got a little meowing! Can meow make dog sounds? Well, <laughs> bark bark. <laughs> Alrighty, on that note, I'm off the video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Thank you for the insane amount of support on the channel recently. I really do appreciate it. Uh, happy holidays once again, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.